Uh, I'm Michael the Big Show Richardson. I'm fighting on behalf of the Sandbar, the Randalls. Randy would be in the corner, but he's too busy getting pissed on the table. I'd shout out to them, but they probably wouldn't remember. But again, thanks to Randy for forking out to the table for all the freeloaders. I'm really hoping it's short, because I don't have around two or three. He's been really good. We had PT the last two Fridays and he pulled out on, so I'm probably going to lose this fight on behalf of that. So shout out to Nige, thanks for making the 5.30 sessions. In the red corner, sponsored by the Sandbar, please welcome Michael the Big Joe Richardson! And fighting out of the blue corner, Carl Big Yordi Drake. Let's see a little more about Carl. My name's Carl Big Yordi Drake. Uh, I'd like to say a big shout out to my sponsor, Fresh Air Planning. Best planning company in Perth. Uh, the nickname Big Yordi uh, came from the English word naughty. Uh, most annoying person in the fight camp would have to be Glenn. Uh, just won't let off, just always pushing you up, doing things you don't want to do. Yeah, I don't think America called up Germany and told them how they're going to win, did they? We're coming tomorrow. <laughs> Once this is good, yes. <laughs> Thank you, yeah. <laughs> so I know I won't answer that question. And in the blue corner, sponsored by Fresh Edge Painting, please welcome Carl Big Yorty. Alrighty, ladies and gentlemen, I've just been uh, backstage having a great chat with uh, with Mal and uh, Mr. Mal Day here. Um, he is the director of breast cancer care WA, and uh, I mean, he, he, he does a lot of other things as well. We'll, we'll let Shorty the MC intro for a second, and then we'll come back to Mal. Chairman now. Chairman for those uh, listening at home. So Mal. More prestigious. <laughs> And you've got a few events, uh, the Boobalicious Balls coming up in a couple of weeks' time. In two weeks' time, sold out about three months ago with, I think, 350 on the door list now. Love it. Reserve list. So there's a few, pe uh, few friends trying to send you a message saying, come on, mate, get me in. Yeah, block them. <laughs> uh, welcome, though, mate. How are you? Awesome. It was a fantastic night. Well done to the guys setting this up. Glenn and Simon and all the teams done an awesome job. Alrighty, so as we were saying sort of backstage just then, uh, Mal and I, we think this is going to be a very entertaining fight. Um, the boys have, uh, I, I think they've still been having a couple of frothies in the lead up in the, in, the, in the training camp. So I think there's going to be some big heavy hits being thrown in the first to try to finish the other one. Some Armadale style, style overhand rights. <laughs> so uh, the, the two of these guys, they're probably the, the two funniest guys I've met in my life. So... This is going to be a cracker. Ooh! Blue corner start off oh. with a great, great <laughs> shot there. Richo just feeling him out. Blue corner's got his hands up. Well, that's good. Good. So, oh, Red's throwing the A band right. I like it. I, I, was, I was expecting just big, huge, heavy right straight away, but they've. These guys, are, this is entertaining fight, guys. They're doing well. 
Let's hope they can last a full three rounds. <laughs> Downside of drinking a lot of beer. <laughs> Carl, the big Carl, naughty Drake. He's, uh, he's got his game face on. Oh, goes for the big oh. right uppercut. A mean business. One could get oh. knocked out here. How much do these guys weigh? <laughs> they're both uh, they're both up over 100 kgs. Well, you don't want to get hit with one of those hooks, let me tell you. So we've we've obviously got in the blue corner Carl Big Naughty Drake and his sponsor is Fresh Edge Painting, fighting for the gobsmacked belt. In the red corner, we've got Michael the Big Joe Richardson, fighting for the Sandbar out in Scarborough. I love Sandbar, one of my favourite places. It's a good, it's a good, good relaxed, um, you know, restaurant, bar, good views of the beach. I've been going there for I think 25 years. I play chess there every, every couple of weeks on a Saturday afternoon. I have a few drinks. Ooh, both, both still feeling each other out. Big Ooh, punches, but big some shot. good jabs, some good overhand rights. Getting a bit apprehensive, I think. Ooh, Ooh big shot. Who do you think's winning at the moment, Mal? I think it's a draw. They're both, they're both connected, okay? They're both throwing some big shots. They're both getting a bit puffed. Both are, both are breathing. 10 seconds. Oh, you know, oh, oh. It's all about they're giving it 100%. A good duck there from Blue Corner. Big oh. overhand right from Blue Corner. Oh, oh. There's a lot of fresh air shots there and from both sides. they're sucking them in. They're sucking them in. They, over they go to the okay. corners. Take a seat. Take a seat, boys. Their coaches are now going to... Relax. Give them, their, give them their, you know, this is what you're doing right, this is what you're doing wrong. I and Karen with me here from the Perth over to the interview. Center, major sponsor for the event tonight. Karen, you must be so happy to see events back up and running. Yes, it's amazing tonight. We have a sellout crowd. So good to be running live events again. So just contact me when you want to have an event here. This is the place to be. Thank you. And are you enjoying yourself? Amazing night. Thanks, Simon. And the team from Suited and Terrace yes. events. Enjoy the rest of your evening. The downside of Thank you. No, That's why that's it's showing. Seconds out. So he doesn't have to be sitting there. Yeah. Big Carl Drake, one of the uh, one of the greatest painters on, Perth has boys, seen. And Very successful business. Two. And Richo, he's in commercial real estate, so he knows how to get a deal done. So he is trying to put pen to paper here and finish this one. Oh, but Red Corner threw a lot of punches there. Not many of them hit. They all hit Blue Corners. Oh, he's going to come at him. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> throwing down the gauntlet. Oh, he not says, sure come was, at me. I'm not sure if it's the right thing to do. <laughs> I'm not sure if you get the crowd on your side by doing that, Mal. No. Oh, a little little trick shot there. Bit of an uppercut and a hook. Two good jabs. Oh, Blue loves those overhand rights. Does Reds bring them straight back at him. They're both, they both got to get their hands up a bit now. They're going to get hurt. There's a lot of kilos behind those punches. <laughs> They're both definitely sucking them in early, aren't they? But they're giving it 100% and it's not easy to breathe out there. Knowing some bloke's trying to knock you out. Glenn Austin, what's he saying? I think Glenn might knock himself out the way he's trying to <laughs> <punch> <laughs> Ooh! Oh. A good right hand, but it missed from the blue corner. Yeah, the old umpire says, do not turn your back. He's, no. saying, he's telling them off. No punches in the back of here. Got to defend yourself at all times. Glenn Austin loves the overhand right. I think I reckon Blue's going to throw a few more of them. Try to finish it early. Oh, Richo pushes oh, him, pushing oh, him over. Yeah. Pushing's not acceptable, generally. Isn't it? I think it is. Yeah, yeah in MMA. <laughs> it's Glenn. a charity fight. Yeah. Oh. That's right. oh, almost anything goes. No, and no uh, and the ref around. says no more. Spinning around, he's got to keep his head up. He's got to keep facing it, the boxer. Yep. And uh, that big Pension. Richo. Richo's putting the pressure on him here. Ooh. Oh, big. Lucky that right hook from the red corner didn't connect. Now Great shot. Carlos is chasing him. Yeah. Whoa, my God. Well done. Excellent work, boys. <laughs> Breathing hard. Two rounds in, one to go. The this is entertaining. Championship Absolutely. Belt. You're looking for a mouth guard. Look no further than Gobsmack. They will protect your choppers like no one else. <laughs> this is entertaining stuff. It is. <laughs> uh, is it Kelly Jermaine? 
Uh, I'm not sure. I don't know. I don't know. Let's go. I've got a mate's um, big boat. Always better have a mate with a big boat. Far cheaper. <laughs> and she was out one day on a few other dolly birds. And I went on a little jet ski with her at the front. I was hanging up to like my fingers almost. Seconds out. All righty, here we go. So, the big match sponsor for this one is Gobsmack Sports Mouthguards. is a local WA family-owned and operated business with knowledgeable, experienced dental, prosthetics, and technicians who have worked in the industry for more than 30 years. Make two mouthguards for me too, and they're fantastic. <laughs> Oh, I think it's going to be who can just survive. They're yeah. both absolutely exhausted. Who can, who can keep the hands up and who can keep breathing without getting hit? <laughs> They're both just trying to hold on. Ladies and gentlemen, get by the big show and big Yuri. Go on, love. Oh, they love each other. Get around them. Keep going, boys. They are trying to hurt each other. They're both trying some fantastic Oh, the backwards. I don't mind the old backwards hand. Another MMA thing often type punch. They are both exhausted, boys. <laughs> They're still oh. going for it, bud. Good still jab there from Richo. Showing a lot of leather. McCarl's landed some Big good go, combinations Big tonight. Big go, Big oh, the boys are just exhausted. I think, I think they've got a couple more big punches left, but Big hook oh. from overhand right. Here we go. Carl actually wanted to lean come over on, then. Come on, boys. They're about to hug. <laughs> no, come on. A few more punches left for sure. A bit more coming. <laughs> <laughs> he's just pushed it. No, that's a slip. Oh, he's down. That's a slip. down. The oh, last no. minute. Who's got to let that? Neither of them want to go. Oh, yeah. Here both we go. exhausted. No, they're still giving it 100%. Big up, big up a cut breathe. there. Big right hand now from Richo. They just don't. Oh, have good cut. jab from Red Corner. Oh, Luke Richo. Luke turned around again. <laughs> We've got Luke Percival next to me. Carl's good. Luke's throwing some big oh, leather. Oh. They are looking tired out there, boys. Oh, but this right is entertaining from, boxing. Right and they are red giving corner. it everything. Couple of whacks there from the rock, from the blue Who's corner. Who's going to win? Who's going to give it the last ten seconds of oh, what they got? Ooh, hard to call that one. They're both. Ah, that they are get out. We are together, ladies and gentlemen, for the boys. Well done, guys. That was awesome. A huge job to get through the three rounds. They had a gentleman's agreement in the build-up to the fight I can help to it. basically. Get the job done on a limited campaign. <laughs> to the credit of both of them, they've got through the three rounds tonight. They are out on their feet, but they've given us some great entertainment. And they've really put it on. So once again, a big round of applause for the two big fellas that have absolutely left it all in the ring for us tonight. He can't hold himself up. See the boys who are fighting for Gobsmack, the Gobsmack Championship belt. Uh, please, a big round of applause. We welcome Jade from Gobsmack into the ring to present the belt tonight. So good to have Gobsmack on board as one of the major sponsors for this year's 2020 Pro 9 Corporate Rumble. Outstanding, the best mouth guard in the business. Gobsmack. Touch, that's right. So as we've alluded to, for these guys to get in here tonight, limited preparation, the gentleman's agreement. Once again, it doesn't make it any easier when the lights are on and you are absolutely out on your feet, but they both got through to the end of three rounds. And I'll give you the tip right now, I'm tipping a nice, quiet, cold one for both of them. Won't be too far away from getting down the neck. Very well earned, gentlemen. Continue your donations for Happiness Co, our wonderful charity partners. You're all going to go home to Bruges tonight. It's a split decision, ladies and gentlemen. But the winner, in the red corner, Michael the Big Richardson. You called it. You called just, it. just. Fights, yeah. 
having a red hot crack. Big Cho, uh, congratulations, mate. Uh, no, talk us through night. it. How, it was obviously a gentleman's agreement. You, you decided that you both have a crack. How are you feeling now? It was a simple tactic. He fell forward, I fell back, then I fell forward and he fell back. So all in all, it went well. Look, forward, back, forward, back. In the end, though, you get to go home with the belt. What does that mean for you? It means a lot of piss tonight. A lot of piss. Excellent, you got a few people in the bank. Yeah, thanks to the sandbar, thanks to all my friends and family that came, and thanks to Carl, my coaches, Kyla, Nigel. Love you guys, Glenn. Love you, mate. Well done, guys. Good job. Ladies and gentlemen, put your hands together for Big Joe Michael Richardson. Bait night